agora. Okay, Altos Mountain Race. It's finally there. I'm as excited as I am nervous. And uh, I don't know. We'll see what happens. <laughs> Okay, so second hiker bike, and it's not, I mean, it's asphalt but it's just steep and it's long my bike's heavy and I'm really trying to save myself and uh, uh, at Grand Grange I was uh, going way too fast in the beginning and uh, well I told myself not to do that this time and uh, at least I'm listening to myself back of the pack hiking <laughs> um, it's slowly getting dark on the first day and um, I've been uh, well, we all have been um, walking up this uh, last steep bit of the um, climb to the highest point of the race, the Atlas race, mountain race. And, um, but uh, it's so fucking steep and it's so, it's so undoable. I, uh, oh man, fuck this shit. Came to the infamous mule path after the big climb. A four kilometer long hiker bike down some rocky trail, which is absolutely not rideable. And uh, I don't know, it's uh, really windy, it's cold, it's slightly raining. So um, basically, uh, I'm having a blast. Yeah. <sighs> Yeah. 
Is that a comment? Uh, fuck this shit. <laughs> <laughs> Going down was pretty, pretty nice trail run, wasn't it? Undoable. Well, but you made it to CP1. Yeah. Yeah. yeah well did. done. Well done. Thanks. <laughs> Never huh? Good. No. <laughs> I'm so happy to be here. I'm going to go sleep. <laughs> Thirty-nine. Your comments? So happy, so happy to be here. <laughs> wow. Okay, that's fine. So, okay, day two. Um, it's, uh, uh, I made it to uh, checkpoint one, which is good. I had to sleep, and um, now I'm actually one of the last people, if not the last person, to leave this checkpoint. I mean, <coughs> there's definitely some people up behind me still, but I'm definitely back of the pack now. Um, and I couldn't care less because I just. I don't know, I just wanna, I mean, it has to be fun or I go home or something. I don't know, we'll see. So finally, less climbing, day two. Um, which doesn't say a lot because it's still a lot of climbing. But uh, it's, it, there has been this terrible headwind all day already. Heavy day again. Egg. Egg and bread, that's, that's my stuff. Charging while riding actually works pretty well. <laughs> Never going to happen. <laughs> In my dreams. Yes, that's a good compliment. <laughs> <laughs> I really love the uh, altitude on the Wahoo Rom. The profiles are really clear. I just don't like the profiles. Uh, I made it to the top of a six hour climb. Uh, uh, I would advise on not riding the Atlas Mark. <laughs> Another hike a bike. Love this. <laughs> so 
So there I am sitting in Afra and uh, my buddies have left already. Here's my French friend, he's scratching, calling a cab. And uh, I'm actually, uh, I don't know, I'm fucked up. <clears throat> and um, I'm really appealing to just call it quits and... Uh, uh, sure. uh, I don't know, man. Stop. That's it for me. Hey, I scratched from the Atlas Mountain Race. It's um, it's too hard, <laughs> at least for me. It's uh, you have to do 150 kilometers a day, and I'm not nearly in the neighborhood of that. Today I did 11 hours and uh, 93 kilometers, and I think that's telling. I had a good thought about it. I think that I sat here for like an hour discussing with myself if I'm gonna push on or not. But basically for me, cycling is about having fun on a bike. The fun was kind of gone. And uh, that's for me a uh, sign to call it quits. So had a try, failed, onto the next project. Josh. Erwin here, cap 39. Um, I'm never doing this again. <laughs> oh, Erwin, I'll see you next year then. I heard um, the Silk Road Mountain Race is really good, especially for, um, for experienced beginners like you.